Hi, in this video, we are going to see about a MATLAB project which is entitled as Knee Osteoarthritis Detection and Classification Using X-rays, which is an IEEE 2023 journal paper. Before seeing the execution of the project, let me brief about this project. So basically this knee osteoarthritis is a type of disorder which occurs in the joints of bones. So this is basically a chronic disorder which is affecting many peoples all over the world. And the problem with these knee osteoarthritis is like it makes more painful swelling and also they cannot make any movements on their joints like hands or legs wherever it occurs so yearly detection of this knee osteoarthritis will will help the patients to get recover soon and they can be get diagnosed properly so in this base paper the authors have de de developed a knee osteoarthritis detection and classification based on the x-ray images using various deep learning models and image processing technique but we are not going to use the same as mentioned in the base paper so now let us see about the proposed system so in the abstract of the project you can see about the knee osteoarthritis detection and we have implemented it using matlab and we are going to use two different models one is faster rcn and another one is google net so one is for the detection and another is for classification so we are going to use this faster rcn for detection of knee osteoarthritis and we are going to classify it into different grades as grade 1 grade 2 grade 3 and grade 4 using the google net cnn model so uh, we'll be using these two and uh, our proposed system that is the classification of this using google net achieved 96.95 percentage and we'll be uh, showing the performance analysis parameters like error precision recall specificity of fun score and mcc values so this is about the abstract of our project so in the existing system we have considered uh, it using various uh, image processing techniques so and disadvantages of the existing system is being mentioned and in the proposed system we have mentioned about the model that we have developed which has both the faster rcn which is region based convolution neural network and next one is google net model which classifies the grade 1 grade 2 grade 3 and grade 4 so this is all uh, things that is mentioned which i have discussed and these are the advantages of the proposed system and coming to the system architecture so we'll be giving the input as knee x-ray image which will be making the pre-processing and uh, knee osteoarthritis detection will be done using the faster rcn and the knee osteoarthritis classification will be done using google net cnn and the grades will be displayed here and uh, let me see about the modules these are the modules that is image acquisition pre-processing knee osteoarthritis detection knee osteoarthritis classification and performance measure so these are the module descriptions and we have the hardware and software requirements as mentioned we'll be developed using matlab and the tool that we are using is matlab or 2021 e and this is the base paper reference so far let me show you the data set part so in the coding we have the data set folder which has the grade 1 grade 2 so grade 4 so here you can see this is a great sample of uh, grade 1 image and this is of grade 2 images that we are going to train up the system and these are the grade 3 images and these are the grade 4 images so basically this uh, grades is being classified as uh, of knee osteoarthritis like grade 1 means it is doubtful and uh, in it is if it is grade 2 it is mild grade 3 means it is moderate and if it is grade 4 it is a severe so it basically it is classified like that so now let us see the execution of the project so first go to the source code location copy the source code location now open matlab or 2021a so in the address bar i will just paste the location that i have copied and click enter so now you can see the code is being loaded in the left side panel so now let me select the final dot m and then right click it and then click run now kindly wait for a few minutes so now you can see the 
GUI of our project, which has our proposed title, Deep Learning Based Knee Osteo or Thread Detection and Classification. So we have the process of test image, pre processing, knee osteo detection, knee osteo classification, performance analysis, whatever we mentioned in the modules part. So first, let me click the test image. So in the source code folder, we have the test images. So you can select the images that is available in the test image, or you can also use the images that is available in the data set part that we have trained up the system. Let me show you both. So for example, in the test images, let me select an image and then click. This is the image that I have uploaded. So you can see the test X-ray image here. Uh, let me click the pre-processing and here you can see the resized image this is the pre-process step and next coming to the new osteo detection just click it so now the new osteo detection detection part will be done it take few seconds to load the model into the system so kindly wait for few seconds So now you can see the model has been loaded. Message and click OK. So now you can see the detection part is done using the faster or CN. So it, it has detected and you can see the score of it. And next one is the classifying using Google Net. So just click this new osteoarthritis classification. So the pre-trained model will be loaded for the classification. And here you can see using Google Net, it has classified the test image that we have uploaded as grade two. So in this way, you can check with the images. Let me show you with the, now I have shown you with the test image folder. Now let me go to the data set folder. We go to the grade one. Let me select an image which is available here. And let me click the pre-processing. And now you can see the resized image here. And let me click the detection part. So this knee osteo detection takes few seconds to load the model into the system. So kindly wait till that. So now you can see the faster RCN has detected with the score of it and let me go for the classification part. And so now the Google Net architecture has classified the new osteo as grade 1. So now let me run the again, let me select the to go to the data set part, In grade 2 let me select an image and go for the pre-processing reduction part and now you can see the detected part with the score of it and let me go for the classification So this time it has predicted wrongly so it is uh, uh, we have selected the image from grade 2 but it has predicted as grade 1 so because um, we cannot say that it predict all the images exactly so we got accuracy of 96 percentage so there may be one or two uh, uh, wrong classification so i have shown you with the wrong classification right now so now let me go to the data set again in grade 2 let me select another image which is available and go for the pre-processing detection part So detected part with faster RCN and let me go for the classification. And now you can see it is correctly picked as grade 2. So as mentioned there may be one or two few things it may show classify wrongly because uh, there is no 100% accuracy model. So now let me go to the grade 3 
images now let me select an image from grade 3 any of the image randomly and go for the pre-processing and this is the resized image and go for the detection part so you can see the detected part using faster rcn and let me go for the classification part and now you can see it is predicted correctly as grade 3 here in this part and finally let me show you with the final case with the test image of the data set in the grade 4 so now let me select an image from grade 4 and give pre-processing and go for the reduction part Now you can see the detected part with the predicted score and let me go for the classification. So now you can see it has predicted correctly as grade 4 using the Google Net. And in this way you can check with the other images that is available in the test or in the train folder that we have given. So to make the video shorter I am going to skip the things and go to the next part go to the performance analysis so just click this performance analysis so it takes some time for calculating the calculations and the available in the performance analysis so in the module you can see the performance analysis uh, things like accuracy error rate precision value recall sensitivity that is specificity f score and uh, mcc that is matthews correlation coefficient all these calculations will be made so you need to wait till you see if you see this completed message so it means that the process is completed now in the console window you command window you can see the details of it so now let me show you one by one so first thing is like you can see the confusion matrix so confusion matrix contains the true and predicted label of the grades that is grade 1 grade 2 grade 3 and grade 4 you can see the details of the confusion matrix and uh, and comes the performance analysis this is the performance analysis of google net that is the classification part so which contains accuracy of 96.95 percentage and error as 0 0.0305 and precision as 0.9718 specificity as 0. 9895 and sensitivity as 0.9706 f1 score as 0.9709 and mcc as 0.9608 and this is all about the performance analysis and which is about the confusion matrix and you can see the the command prompt about the calculation which is made and this is all about the project knee osteo authority detection using and classification using x-rays Thank you for watching.